واي حاجه نضيف هو حاجه لي وحي وارك سؤال اعدو قيمه بدن سؤال شيء وانو كويتي هي او يو دفع كم معنى يدو عدرك تشوكين حتى نسيت اي قطع عطيني اي يدو نسيت اي وحكا فرطو تاريخ دا وحي سؤال شيء كويتي هي انو 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 كويتي هي لا لا أونو ذي أو أح بركان بحرية تبرك بدل يو أسمع لك كان يسوون تجويني هاي يو بين دروس خاصة إنه قطيع شيء كذي وهذا بحيق قيمة على قاع نصور دم قي وحتى هذا أنا نقدر كتير تجويني أهل كيف تجويني ولا كيف ب هي حقوقي كتير توب يكسر سفري جوات كسر كذي ولا صوص العيد والعذاب تجويني حنون كافر هبدان لي إن سفر ذو إلا هو وشيء كذي بلاي نقطون بين دروس خاصة أنا قيمة في ربنا الحين درادة تبع أي تعبت هاي من دون إنسان يروح بقرطه ما صارت صرت كل كتير مهم وأركته إن أمة تاريخ تبي يوحنا في سوامر لا تعبته أنا إنت أبو تري يسي أنا ديو بعين ويفوش معي ده. One thing I've learned about Somali society is it's always good to let women have the last word and they will anyway even if you don't let them. So. We're going to have one more question from a, from a lady on the floor. Thank you. Continue from the question about our about our history. A lot of us know that our history is more spoken and not written. And coming from London myself and growing up there, and I've always been interested in our history, but there's nowhere to find out about it. So how would you recommend that people who are interested and want to find out more about it, to find out from sources and stuff like that? Thank you. Well, um, what I recommend is there are a few libraries in London, some as, some as library, um, there are um, the British Library, also outside of London in Cardiff there's a place called the Butte Town Arts and History Centre which has got interesting photos of the Somali community in Cardiff. Um, you have to get information from every last source. So, like Mamma Boy, I was reading a lot of books written in the 1850s or 19, early 1900s, which are written by uh, British colonels or majors, and are quite, you know, they're, they're not looking at things from an empathetic angle, but they have um, interesting facts, so about the landscape of, of Somalia, or Somalia and the way it used to be, you know, you can still get information and you have to kind of filter it yourself and make use of it yourself. There's now the internet and um, what I'd like to do in the future, actually, we haven't talked about this, but um, I've got this idea and uh, I've spoken to Mary Harper and I know that there's a few people with the same idea, which is to set up an online museum for Somali history or Somaliland history. So everything that we have now, before it quickly disappears, the songs, the culture, the, the stories, the the narratives, the individual narratives could be gathered and then put all on the internet. I know that the Americans did a similar thing in the 1930s with the Federal Writers Project. And I read them now and I'm fascinated because there are slave narratives from people who are 90 years old and who saw amazing things. So I'd like there to be a concerted effort to record some art history and make it available to everyone. Can I also, I'm going to take the chair of prerogative and say also something about that, which is that there are many of you in the audience who have a historical memory that needs to be written down and you need to think and amongst yourselves or, or think for yourself about what you can say about your own history because it's not, you're right, it, a lot of it isn't written down and from a, from a scholar's perspective um, we really would, would value hearing much more about your own personal experiences of the war, of the pre-war period, the colonial period if you can remember that, that's very important. Well, yeah, I give a good way to talk now. As I should put the base, say, I'm a comment to the base or we are. I'm not an oral society, it's the way I let I make running in a low or in a half. One contribution, it can store in a community case to get a car to a case a car to a different and no shape. They get a lot of folk and they can't figure it out. Uh, we're not doing in a semi online museum. 
Wahala lagi wihi usah sana bertarik ama sugan ama heso ama music ama sheko ama shakari wahala lagi wihi umat dari dia dah hai internet dari dia dia orang kan disukai wana mereka leh di ni sesuatu tapi ini kamu di nu dari dalam rasa itu kau kita bawa banyak khusus wahaya khusus hiji yang kau kita kami ni mereka email disku dari dia atau mesra lupa dia raya wahai ada nak apa hisa ina hari belum ini atau email juga Wah, ay kalau optimal tu, mana ha? Darah hands di ini sila nak kita buat ayu ini ni sih. Hal kau sih, lagi ini kalau tarian tu lagi ini kalau mereka dah lulus di library opi ala London ayu optimal tu. Wah kalau perlu kita buat cerita, mungkin ada cerita lagi. Madam ayah saya kerja untuk pelajaran, okelah fikir sen. Mereka kerja begitu dia, untuk kesusahan kerja. Ayu ini untuk kesusahan saya memang cukup kena, ayu memang. Ah dia belum hati dia. وحوها سشن هذه هذا الضيم بلد وحينو بعدنا إنا شرمي أو أبريك وعاد كلمنا يا جورج كارفيس 